Okay, guys, yes, if you go shopping all around Portland for flowers this week leading up to Valentine's Day, there's a big chance those flowers you buy in whatever store actually came from here. We are at the Portland Flower Market in North Portland. It's basically a big warehouse just full of all kinds of flowers that look beautiful and smell wonderful. And so we are going to see a little behind the scenes of how it all comes together. We have Amy. She's the manager at Mayesh, one of the vendors here at the Portland Flower Market. You are giving us an example. This is what a florist could come in and say, okay, I need this order of this and this and this, exactly. and then you guys put it together for them? Yep. yep, exactly. How does it work? They call us on the phone, let us know what they need, or um, sometimes they just come in and shop and lay it here on the table, and then we pack it up for them. That's so crazy. And then at their different flower shop, they might make different arrangements, but you guys kind of sell it in bulk? All in bulk, yep. Wow. Okay, so this is what you would normally do? This is a normal little, it's a little order, yep. And of course, this week you have a lot of little orders, a lot of big orders, because it's one of the big, busiest week this of the year. Busiest week of the year, yeah. That's so crazy. What is this that you just put in there? That's Brasilia. Whoa, uh -huh. beautiful. So obviously you guys have a lot of amazing things in here. A lot of different kinds of flowers really that come unusual, from yes. all over the world. Mm -hmm. All over the world. And a lot of people think Valentine's Day, red roses. So many other maybe options. Maybe pink roses. You do have some red roses for us, but even the red roses you put out, they look a little different. Tell me about these giant red Those roses. Those are uh, 120 centimeters. Can you guys see these? These flowers, um, maybe as tall as my entire body. So someone could buy one of these we for sell a statement them in, piece. We sell them in bulk to yeah. the florist, and you could buy them from the florist individually or however they want to sell them. So even if you do red roses, you know, do it a little differently. And then you have some really cool things. These come from Japan. Japan. What are those? Those are Gloriosa lilies. Wow. We have some hydrangeas from Peru. Lysianthus, it came from um, Holland. That's up in the front? Yeah. Oh, those are beautiful. They come from Holland. So basically these things come from all over the world. All over and the then world. you guys are in charge of bringing it all them together. alive still yeah. and beautiful before yeah. they get go out to the customers. Yep, exactly. That's amazing. It seems like most people probably don't know that when they go shopping for their flowers, yeah. they all come from mm -hmm. this one big place one big place somewhere here on the market is it hard to keep them all looking alive and vibrant and beautiful <laughs> it's a challenge but it, you know <laughs> it's fun yeah <laughs> we love it so red rose is probably the most popular for valentine's day it is but people could definitely switch it up and what's the next like biggest best seller for this maybe week a, so far? another color of uh, uh -huh. roses we've got you know some peaches and uh, pinks Ooh, yeah and then even the little kumquats mm -hmm. i wouldn't think about fruits in your flowers, but you said those are big for this They're time of year? They're big this time of year, yeah. Wow. Okay. Well, thank you, Amy. Portland Flower Market, definitely very, very busy, so we will let you get back to work. Thanks. Leading up to Valentine's Day. All right. <laughs>